video on how to import your pictures from an SD card into your Windows 10 operating system. So find the slot on your computer for your SD card. Mine happens to be buried under here. Now what happens is you'll see a bar pop up on the right hand side as soon as I click it in. It's been clicked in and then this shows up. Select what to Select to choose what happens with memory cards. The problem is that message only stays up there for about five seconds. So if you've missed that, you don't know what to do. The easiest thing to do is go to your search bar, which I recommend to everybody to use as much as possible, and just type in photo. And you'll see the first thing that comes up is photos. And that's a built-in app for Windows 10, which is my dog. Now, up here in the top corner, you'll see this symbol here. Top right corner, you got this. It says import. Click on import, and you'll see it has said select items to import from E, which is that card we put in. <clears throat> These are all the new pictures that were in that card. You can then go down to continue. And now we can just start importing and say we want to put them someplace other than the default. So we can say change where they're imported to. We can go over here and choose pictures. We can do new folder. And, you know, we can just type in, I'll just type in whatever there. And then we'll say add this folder to pictures. <clears throat> there we go. And you can see here it's now changed to pictures that KKHG. And then here we have the option of deleting the items from the card after we import them. Or if we leave that, uh, if we leave that unchecked, it's going to leave a copy on the card as well. So you'll still have a copy on there. So then we just have to go down here. We'll click on import. And that's it. You can see right here at the top. And then down here, this has popped up. Now if you go to your folder down here, right there, you can bring up your desktop manager screen. You can click on pictures. There's that folder that I created. And you can see there are the imported photos right there. All right, so that's all there is to it.